Happen, tofu? Dear, today in school, our teacher asked us to write something about the wolf. So why don't you write about it? But Tia, I don't know anything about how a wolf behaves. Come, let me tell you a story and then you would be able to figure out how it behaves. The Wolf and the Crane One day, a hungry wolf was eating his prey. So rapidly that a bone got stuck in his throat. He ran around the forest howling in pain. Please help me. I will reward handsomely. Anyone who removes the bone from my throat. Passing crane to pity on the wolf. Even though the task was dangerous, the lure of the prophet motivated him to help. So he decided to help him. I will help you, but you need to stay still. I'll look down your throat and then remove the bone. As promised, the crane did his job. Now give me my reward. Reward? What reward, you greedy fellow? You had your head in my throat and instead of eating you up, I let you go unharmed. That should be reward enough for you. Go away or I'll crush you. The crane walked away disappointed. Although he felt happy that he had helped in saving someone's life. So what did you understand from this story? That one cannot trust the cunnings of a wolf. Right Tofu. And now would you be able to write about the wolf? Yes Tia. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. But why do we get hiccups? Hiccups are funny ones. Most simple cases of